this is so cool, look. <clears throat> and it's all coming from the ceiling, or not the ceiling, the roof. upgraded us it's so pretty good thing they didn't have the other one available but look at the view wow there's the bathroom wow first of all there's a lot of people but it's still really pretty Then when you get closer, you realize, you know, there's reinforcements and everything. Look at that. Got the chicken Caesar sandwich. We also got some cookies and some drinks. I got the mocktail. It's like a lychee um, grapefruit mocktail. And then Ben got the Singapore sling. Look how pretty it is though. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. Um, yeah, especially with all the lights on. You can see the Merlion. You can see the Fullerton Hotel. I really want to go there, but we're probably going to go there tomorrow or the next weekend. Literally here at like 7 a.m., but there's a lot less people than last night, especially when we first came, and it's so pretty. Coffee, the raw sugar stick, and the cream. And how was the croissant? So good. Which one did you try? I had the kaya. Oh. I'm gonna put this in and then put some cream as well. Sugar though. I only spent one night in Marina Bay Sands, but this is our new hotel, and I'm so excited to see the room. Um, this lobby is so pretty. I also have such this hotel is the Shangri La near Orchard Road which honestly like the other hotel was quite pricey and I just wanted to see the infinity pool so this one is still pricey but it's definitely not as much like I think it's like less than half of the price per night at the Marina Bay Sands I'm glad I got to stay there it's so iconic so it was cool to see it in person Newton Food Center Gotta go to my bitch and other stories. <laughs> Always a good time for a beverage, you know. Look at how cute this holder is. like you have like your wedding here or something this is the view that we saw 
and we were over here, right in the middle. Got one of the Thai coconuts. It's just so yummy. Oh, this is so good. It's so sweet. just right next door to the cloud floor so it's super easy to get to and I think if you buy tickets you have to buy both of them together I'm not sure but I've only ever come to these two together it's so nice though because it is air conditioning After much walking and just trying to find a place to sit, we just ended up here. It looks so good. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> throw back. <laughs> faster, faster, faster. <laughs> Raffles. We're actually exploring a different part of it and we're going to go to the bar where the Singapore sling was invented So of course we had to get that drink, but I just love this hotel so much. It's so beautiful Like you can tell by the high ceilings and like the pillars and everything. I'm obsessed I love how there's like little stories for every single one and they're all connected like for every single drink that tells you the story I've got it. So you can read all of them. They're all inter interconnected in the same like universe. I literally kept this just so I can read the stories. The little pea finally got our Kaya toast. Let me dip it in here. Can't go wrong with diet oh. and butter. Mm. We're here has Laneige and like all these other brands and Sado, but I'm so surprised that they have this in like all of like the shades. Adventurous too. The modern, modern dandy. dandy. Okay. Try the Ah Thai Hainanese chicken rice, and I think the Tian Tian one is better, but the rice is better for this one. And then this laksa, apparently Tibetan tastes shrimpy, but I love this taste of like shrimp and seafood, so I'm gonna be the one eating this. It's so much pretty here at night. 
We're here at Marina Bay Sands and we're very used to this now. We've been here so many times, but we've never been here at night. So I'm excited to see the light show. taro boba because my friend Ali always talked about how she loved taro boba and she can't find it in America so here it is and I'm going to drink it for the last day that I'm in Singapore this was so good we had to come back for seconds today here at Watson's last time I was here I went to the one in China I love stores like this so oh what are you gonna get you got six packs oh. Yeah, I mean, you might as well. You're probably gonna use it anyways. All the skincare. Oh. About to leave. Bye, Ben. Bye. I'll see you in New York. <laughs> a taxi over here and the taxi lady was super super nice she was telling me all these places that i should go in the airport while i'm waiting here and i didn't realize i'd never been to like all of like the other like the whole check-in counters in singapore airlines but they occupy like 10 of these which i guess makes sense like they have like a whole row for or like a whole two rows for economy and then they have like a whole row for business first class premium economy bag drop all that kind of stuff like literally all of this is just for Singapore Airlines. Anyways, I am now free. I just had two bags with me, my carry-on bags, and I'm gonna head over to Jewel because last time we were there, we got to take pictures and everything, but I had like all my bags. So I kind of want to walk around there without like having so much stuff on me, you know? So I just passed by the lounge and I wanted to check it out for myself. I probably won't stay here for too long, maybe like 15 minutes or like one drink or something to charge my electronics um, and see if I want to go to any of the shops here. So we'll see. I don't know if there's actually any shops that I'm interested in just because I'm not sure if there would be any less expensive than in the US, but I don't know, we'll walk around, maybe check out some more lounges once I pass security, and I need to check my stuff anyways and download some things for the plane, so glad I stumbled upon it. I loved this store when I was in Japan, oh my gosh, they have it here too. <gasps> Loki though, this Luxo is actually pretty good. Not as good as like the one that I had at the Hawker Center, but it's pretty good considering it's like airport lounge food, you know? 